Hello everybody, this is Mo. This is Mo Chat. This is your earthquake info time. It is now 4.03 p.m. It is also October the 27th, 2016. Okay, today has apparently been a rough day for a lot of people. <clears throat> Let's get right into this, okay? Just three minutes ago, about 4 p.m. our time, down in Chile, San Antonio, Valparaiso, Chile, 5.9 just happened. 5.9. According to the reports, it is 14 kilometers deep. Six people did report on that, okay? It is being reported on. Um, there is some economic losses going on there. It did happen just offshore of Chile, okay? But it was big enough to where lots of people are reporting now. Um, <clears throat> six call-ins about it. Also, kind of um, southwest of Santiago, right there on that coastline, the Peru-Chile Trench is right there as well. This was a 5.9. Also, we need to be a little bit concerned about off the coast of California, northwest, 4.1, in an area that they are calling Ferndale. Okay, 4.1. Happened there. That's northwest California. Right off that coast. It is off off the land, okay, offshore. But it was a 4.1. Now, <clears throat> the reason why I pointed out those two big ones first is I want to remind everyone that is in the Ring of Fire. It is connected to the Aleutian Trench, the Alaskan Peninsula, is also in the Ring of Fire. And Alaska today having earthquakes. Okay, 4.1. 4.1 right off that coast of California. And then we move on up. And we've got a 5.8. <clears throat> Very, very close to that volcano called Pavlov. Okay. There is also two other ones right next to Pavlov. One of them is called um, the Little Sister. Let me make sure of what they're calling that. There is three of them positioned there. Okay. There is Pavlov Sister, Pavlov, and then Little Pavlov. Okay, so there's three of them right together. The biggest one is Pavlov itself, which has erupted, okay, in our lifetime. The other two have probably erupted in the last 10,000 years. That is what USGS is saying about them. Okay, I'll look that information up. Um, I will be sure and get you a... A link to the page where I'm reading this information and at this time I will remind people that there is a fair use statement that I can use information in reporting okay so that's what I'm doing but I will give you the link to where you can go read it for yourself it is at geology.com okay information coming in about that Pavlov there Volcanoes, pretty big, right there. Okay, then there was another, another earthquake up there, a 3.2, still not very far from that Pavlov, not very far at all. And in the Aleutian Trench, okay, the southern portion of um, what is known as the Alaskan Peninsula, still going on right there. So we've had. <clears throat> two pretty good sized earthquakes 
in the Alaska area, okay, very close to that Pavlov. And then we had the 4.1 on the northwest coast of California, and then we just keep coming down, and Chile's right down there as well. And Chile had that 5.9 just three minutes ago. So there are people reporting on that as well. Let's see if anyone's reporting on this one here. No reports on this one. It was a 5.8 false pass, Alaska. So close to that Pavlov. So close. Okay. <clears throat> that 4.1, 135 people have reported on the 4.1 that happened on the northwest coast of California. Very close to Oregon, right offshore in an area they call Ferndale. Okay. So, 135 people have reported on that. <clears throat> they are asking for people to report. If you felt that, anything at all, please report it, okay? They are asking for that. If you felt it, report it. <clears throat> also, 14 minutes ago, Valdez, 2.9 just happened. 14 minutes ago. And that is just east of Anchorage, okay? East of Anchorage. And we can continue on. Willow, Alaska. Cape Yagataka, Alaska. Talkeetna, Alaska. Nikiski, Alaska. <coughs> Alaska, Alaska, just every other report I'm getting is Alaska. Three hours ago, Italy, again, a 4.6. Italy hit again. Remember yesterday they had that 6.1 there in um, the marches. Today is a 4.2. Right there in approximately the same area, Umbria, the same area. 4.2 again today. Only 10 kilometers deep. People are reporting about this now. Three people have reported. Um, it has been reviewed. And they are asking for any report. Any at all. If you were there, you felt it, you heard it. Um, please report on that, okay? We will continue here. Nikolsky, Alaska, 3.2. That is so, so right there. Right there. Just south, just south of Pavlov. Just south of it. Right on that Aleutian Trench. Still connecting up. Okay, let me see if we have anything else for Russia today. Or for um, Japan. Because that would be right in line with the rest of that. Four hours ago, again, again, again. 4.3 Accutan, Alaska. So, so, these big earthquakes happening so close to each other. 3.2s and up. All, ask, all happening on that Aleutian Trench. Right there, that Aleutian Trench is very, very active right there. So, we just have to keep an eye on it. It's the best thing that we can do is just keep reporting on it. Argentina as well. 4.5 right there. Argentina, La Reosa. <coughs> False Pass, 3.0. Eight hours ago, a 5.8 in Accutan. Accutan, 5.8. So, so close. The Aleutian Trench is active, people, and that is in our ring of fire, and there are volcanoes up there. So we're going to have to keep an eye on that. Don't forget, Mount Hood, Mount St. Helens, 
that's in Washington, and they did have that 4.1 right there off the coast in Ferndale, 4.1. So I say we just keep alert, people. Keep your eyes open. Get you an earthquake kit, seriously. Um, I don't see anything for Oklahoma today. I did look up any report concerning Wyoming. I have not seen any. <coughs> <clears throat> Nine hours ago, 5.8 Accutan. Alaska is just getting slammed. 5.8. Those are pretty big earthquakes right there. I don't see anything. Nothing around Yellowstone or Wyoming. I don't see anything. And that's going back 12 hours. Although 12 hours ago, Italy again, 4.3 in Umbria. That was 12 hours ago. So that would be um, 4 a.m. this morning. So. And a 5.9 in North um, Sulawesi in Indonesia. A 5.9. They're saying a 5.8. Indonesia, just south of the Philippines, 5.8. We are having large earthquakes, it seems, today. In the past... 13, 14 hours, we've had fives, fours, larger threes, okay? So what's going on with that? I'm going to give you a couple of links to some neat pages to go check out. Things going on with the sun is absolutely amazing. I am not qualified to talk about that. Um, I don't know all the ins and outs of the sun going on. What's going on with that coronal stuff? But you want to check that out? I'm going to give you the pages to check that out. Go look at it and see what's going on with that. The sun observers, people watching the sun, they say the coronal mass and stuff and, and spots on the sun is not acting right, which is causing more pressure for the earth. So let's take a look at that and try to understand it, okay? I'm trying to understand it. I will give you the links so that you can go read it for yourself. All right, this is Mo. This is your earthquake info time. Have a great evening. If I hear anything else, I will come back and tell you. Also, stay tuned for Mo's opinion time coming up. Bye.